Hello and welcome to our video. So in this video, we will explore how to use CDS configuration migration tool, which is to efficiently migrate configuration data within your Dynamic 365 environments. Whether you are working with the solution or managing multiple environments, the configure migration tool provides a streamlined process to move data like entities, field and relationship from one instance to another. Just like here, we can see that there are two different in environment here. One is to customer service trial and second is saying field service and you can see that uh, the records and uh, the records names are same and same goes for the GUIDs. To the begin you need to know to download and install the CDS configuration migration data tool which looks like this. Head, uh, so you have to head over to Microsoft Dynamics 365 and download it, find the link tool. Once download, run the installer and follow the prompts to complete the setup. So this is our source environment and here you can see that these are the records of game with their respective GUIDs 90C, 92C and uh, this is my target environment. Okay, here you can see if I go my target environment, you could say this is customer environment service and uh, here I also have this games entity. So I have it in here as you can see customer service and uh, this is the different organization field service. So here if I create new record with the same uh, just like cricket same uh, name and click on save so as you can see this is the GUID that has been created but if you go back to my source environment and here I open this cricket record so here the GUID is from 90 CFC like that so what I want I want this record the same name and this with the same GUID so if I go to my power apps with this customer in my customer service environment and here you could see there is a data of cricket name record with the different GUID which is not similar to my source GUID. So what I want, I want the same name with the same GUID. For that what I will do, I will use the configuration migration tool. So first let me delete this and now I will open my configuration migration tool. Here what I need to do first, I need to create a schema, click on continue and it is asking my credential and then click on display list of available organization click on login again and here i first i will select my source environment which is in this case field service trial click on login and then i will it is asking me to select the solution so i could also go with the default solution if i want but in this case i have a solution name sol2 so i would select that And then it's, it will ask me like which entities records you want to export. So I would select games, click here, add fields, and then save and export. So it is asking me to give a file name. I will say games name, and then click on save. And it's asking the schema is, uh, is complete. Would you like to export the data? Click on yes. Then I have to save the data to a data uh, save this data to a data file. Let's suppose name give it name data and so uh, saved in downloads. Click on save. So my data is saved on the zip file. Now click on export data. So as you can select this record is added to export data. Schema validation is complete. Now click on exit. Now create schema is done. Export data is part is done. Now I will import the data to my target environment. Click on import data. Click on continue. Same thing login. But this time I will select my target environment which is customer service trial. Click on login. And now I have to select my zip file that I've just exported, downloaded here and click on import data. So as you can see, it is started importing. Once it's done, we could see the, the data here. Click on exit, close it. Now I will refresh it. You could see that all the records would be appear here. So as you can see, all the records are here. And if I open it, you could see the GUID is this similar to my source environments like if i come here just like it is customer service shantanu and if i open this organization field service cricket and as you can see the guid is the similar one and you can check all the guids as here as well this is my source environment and if i go back to power apps this customer service and uh, give it a refresh so here you can see this time in the customer service trial the records name are same and the guid is also the same so that's it from our video please do like and subscribe and if you have any question please share in our comment thank you